Who's there? Help me, Obi-Wan Kenobi. You're my only hope. What's this? The hero may receive a letter, a phone call, or a message that will inform him he must embark on a new direction and life is about to change. The call to adventure may come in the form of a messenger bringing an envelope or a photograph that will entice the hero into another world. A villain may emerge, disrupting the routines of the tribe, and a new reality may be imposed on the community. Sometimes the hero has no available options and will be forced to join an experience without consent. There are heroes who volunteer and who look for adventure, only to be tested by the outside world. Reality will test the hero relentlessly to find out if the protagonist is ready to change. Wait, I just want to say thanks for killing those things. Ah! Damn! A hero will face resistance throughout the journey rigorously. Reality may be transformed but the hero is bound to face resistance since it is part of the universal experience. No matter which side you fight the battle on or which team you are part of, resistance is an inescapable presence. Reality must be transformed through obstacles that the hero must overcome to better understand the different prisms of reality that surround us. to get to the roof. No way! No way! This is crazy! There are two ways out of this building. One is that scaffold, the other is in their custody. You take a chance either way. I leave it to you. Heroes that commit wholeheartedly to the new world are rare. The hero will fight the call to adventure. A manifestation of the resistance. A force that envelops us on a daily basis. We are like fish inside an aquarium and the resistance is the water we cannot see. So, before the protagonist becomes a fish out of water, he will most likely refuse the call to adventure because he must come face to face with a defiant force. The new world will ultimately turn his previously known world into an unbiased reality, so the hero must appease the guardians at the gate of change. Before we carry out a dramatic change within ourselves, we will face inevitable and numerous obstacles. These tests and obstacles exist to be certain that these modifications coincide with the reality of the outside world. Resistance will defy our change before doing permanent shifts in our psyche. People who may love us unconditionally, but may feel comfortable with patterns of meanings they have formed about the world. We like predictable patterns because we want to anticipate the future we create rituals and stories to put everyone we care about into the same frequency. If a sheep runs away from the herd, it risks losing its grip on a social grid. We like to tell ourselves that we have understood the laws that govern the reality at this moment in time. Refusing a call is inevitable. Resistance imposes a harsh reality check on us before departing from a soon-to-be carcass. Wake up! Ah! Where did you find the piece of resistance? The piece of what? The piece of resistance. A hero must appease a force that will try to disqualify the hero from changing worlds. The guardian at the gate is an energy that may come in a multitude of shapes and forms. A force that will test the hero to think twice before crossing a demarcated line. It may be a literal guard who impedes the hero from transitioning. Is there any law against me getting something here? Yeah, me. It's completely unacceptable. What made you think that you could put your hands on my fiance? Look at me, you feel. Not if I can help it. You talk funny, Nash. Where are you from? Lots of different places. Why are you armed, Quintus? Guards! Please don't fight, Maximus or an energy that comes in the form of an internal struggle filled with neurosis. The hero may be fighting back past experiences which have left scars, traumas that the hero is trying to hide, 
burying them deep inside his subconscious. It's a test that will try to block the hero from committing to a journey that will turn his world upside down. To appease the guardian of the threshold, the hero must mirror the force he is trying to fight against. The hero must understand, perhaps feel empathy towards a being with its own internal problems to deal with. In martial arts, fighters use their opponent's strength against them. To approach a herd of buffalo, the Native Americans used to wear the animal's skin, incorporating the hunt within themselves before going for the kill. The hero may become temporarily the guardian at the gate. It is a force that deters the hero, intimidating him from going any further into an unknown reality. In society, many people fail to bypass the guardian and remain struck in a monotonous, unchanging world of conformity. In neuroscience, this resistance is called the critical factor, a term that explains the way the subconscious protects itself from wrong thinking. Like an organism, the brain defends itself from enemy intruders trying to corrupt the body cell. When this wall comes down, there will be no quarter. Learn to bury your guilt with anger. I will teach you to confront it and to face the truth. You know how to fight six men. We can teach you how to engage 600. The hero has refused the call to adventure, but to gather the courage to continue on with his journey, he will gain the skills and orientations from an old wise man or woman. I'm looking for someone. Looking? Found someone you have, I would say. <laughs> right. It's an honor to meet you. No. The honor is mine. 